I just wanted to compete. You know, as a quarterback, my job is to throw. You know, I had a lot of receivers, so I wanted to throw. <laughs> James, coming into this day, is this a day you just wanted to feel that you could solidify your position as maybe the number one pick in the draft? Coming to this day, I just wanted to come in here and compete with my, my teammates. You know, this is the last time I probably get to be with some of them. So I just wanted to come in here and compete. You think you made a pretty good impression with all the throws? And I know I did. I know I did. James, how different is it being able to work here and then go practice something like you said with your teammates? Is it just easier to kind of settle down? Yeah, I mean, it's, it's always easy to settle down. You know, I believe at the combine I showed that. But just being with the guys, man, being with my brothers, you know what I'm saying, was, was so critical and just being able to come back with them, I loved it. Loved every second of it. James, what do you, you think when you see one of your receivers like crash into the barricade? <laughs> I was worried. Yeah. And then I was like, dang, my fault. <laughs> but uh, Pops had a great day. He had a great day. James, you seemed very loose today before the workout, even afterwards. You seemed very loose, very confident, typical James, I assume. But Tell us how you felt going into this workout today. I felt great. You know, last night uh, I did my I did my game ritual. You know, uh, end up going to sleep about one o'clock. You know, uh, just staying up, so anxious, couldn't sleep at all. Cause I'm like, it's game day tomorrow. You know, uh, kept looking at my phone to see was it it time. And I just felt like it was a game. You know, this was a big stage. This was a huge stage just to show everyone how good we are here at Florida State. Uh, come out here, support kids first. You know, do it for little Ethan. You know, just like we do a football game. And uh, that's how I felt it was. Why did you like you number one? Huh? Why should the Bucks select you number one in your opinion? Because I'm the best player in this draft. What is your game ritual? It's like a game ritual last night. Oh, it's a game ritual. Oh, just what I, just what I do. You know, just how I hang, you know, what time I usually go to sleep. That's all. How did you, you feel like you did on your deep throws today? How did you feel like you did on your deep throws today? I felt I did great on every throw. You, you got a tally? I think I had like five incompletions or six. Y'all got a tally? Five? Just about that. I did. I did great on every throw. See, James, are you 100% certain at this point that you're not going to be attending the draft? No, I don't, I don't know yet. The perception is that you pulled ahead. Pick. You could have sat on your lead today. Uh, Who? Oh, you could have sat on your lead today and been a little more conservative. What was the thinking behind? I'm a competitor. 100%, like 100% juicy juice. I'm a competitor. <laughs> you know, when it's time to play football, I want to play football. You know, people don't get this. People don't get this chance. Y'all don't understand. It's so many brothers where I'm from and, and all these inner cities that are great players but never get to see this day, whether it's trouble or whether, you know, they don't have the opportunity. I'm doing it for all of them, you know. That's what all of us are, are here for, you know what I'm saying? So I'm representing, I'm telling you. I know you spent a lot of time in the last few months kind of dealing with questions about off the field stuff. Was it nice to avoid that and be here and just play? This is my sanctuary, man. I've been saying that for the longest time. I love this place, you know. And being with teams, just a at-home feeling. What's his process been like from... Sure. What's his process been like from the combine to you know meeting with Goodell to meeting with you know the Bucks to, to now Pro Day? What's it all been like for you? It's been a huge job interview, bro. It's been a huge job interview, and I, I've loved it. You know, this is the first time I've been able to be a quarterback year-round. Uh, this is the first time I've been able to just sit and talk to eye, talk to another man eye to eye about what they may think about me or about what I might do. It's not like talking to the media. You're talking to another man eye to eye about why, why should they pick you, you know. So this has been a very enjoyable process, and uh, I love every second of it. If it's something dealing with football, I love it. James, you said that this is your sanctuary. You said this is your sanctuary. Elliot. You're not going to be, you're not going to be. five minutes. Huh? You call this your sanctuary, not to be around here. Now that you're going to be away from the sanctuary, some other football players, new teammates, will be still the same Every football field is my sanctuary. The locker room is my sanctuary. Football is my sanctuary, you know. I don't, I'm not just talking about the field, you know. I'm talking about everything. And I mean everything, everything dealing with my teammates, my brothers, um, the locker room, just a, being, a, being a great teammate to, to the players that I've, that I've, the past three years that I've been with, you know what I'm saying? The same of you is a, like, it's my, this is my fraternity. That's what I mean. It's, these are my brothers.